All right, so that brings us on to uh, Mayweather and Pacquiao. Uh, Rodell, you have some stuff you want to talk to about that as well, I believe. Yes, um, I believe they finally agreed that they'll do some U.S. anti-doping agency, Olympic-style testing for drugs uh, for the fight May 2nd. And the reason for this is the fight was supposed to happen in 2009, but Mayweather wanted to do random drug tests on Manny Pacquiao. Which later, Manny Pacquiao won $5 million on a lawsuit for making his name look bad. So that's that's about it on that. What I wanted to bring up was um, they, uh, they, they recently had their um, face-to-face showdown. Uh, I think it was this past weekend. And throughout the course of that, you know, Manny, he's been torn around. Uh, different television shows and giving him his opinion and he's been really cocky saying that he would he he sees no no fight in this really being a, a competition and just he's talking a lot of trash so i don't know if this is any different than any other fight because fighters always talk trash but it just seems like he's doing a lot of the talking and mayweather is really quiet on this one so manny just uh focus on the fight would be my advice do fighters ever focus on the fight? There's always some type of outside something going on. This guy's doing that. We'll just see what happens on May 2nd when they fight. Well, usually Mayweather's the one talking trash, and Pacquiao's been backing off, just saying, oh, we'll let the promoters do their business. I think this is a little sh- strategic plan on Pacquiao's part in getting in his head, because when it comes down, once they get in the ring, Pacquiao, he's good. Mayweather's going to remember all this, and he's going to want to trade blows and try to hush Pacquiao up, and that's what Pacquiao wants. He wants him just, to come to him so he just cannot think, fight. Pacqui- Pacquiao's been waiting for this fight forever, so he has a whole he has an entourage around him, and all his people, all they've been telling him this whole time is Mayweather is scared. Everywhere he sees it, when are you going to fight Mayweather? So he wants to get in there just as bad as Mayweather does, but he's really acting like overlooking the possibility of him losing this fight it's like out of the realm of possibilities that he'll lose so i I don't know if he should go in with that mentality so you're saying he seems overconfident just just a tad bit from just just the quotes i've seen and just seeing him on television have you ever heard a boxer go into it like oh i think i might lose but i'm gonna give it my best no you don't you you don't have to say that but have you heard anything from uh from mayweather of, of that nature during during the course of the, leading up to this fight, we haven't heard anything. He's been quiet. So I mean, we know Mayweather's confident, but he's not saying anything. So there's just different ways to approach it. Well, we heard Mayweather before the fight actually is going to take place. He was talking all this crap about Filipinos and Pacquiao, but since they signed the dotted line, now he wants to keep it on the hush because he doesn't want to piss off Pacquiao anymore than he already has. Really? Okay. So he's what? What happens if he pisses off? Pacquiao, nothing. I mean, well, he, there's Mayweather nothing to lose by talking. talking. Is... No, he's not. But he did there's talk a reason. In the past, he's right? focused. I'm just saying, there comes a, a point where you got to be focused, and I don't know if Pacquiao's focused at this point. I don't. I don't know. One thing I do that's, think that's just my opinion. One thing I do think about Pacquiao is that he's probably been hungry for this fight for a long time. So, I mean, he's wanted to fight Mayweather for how many years now has it been now? And there's no other turn but him. He's the last fighter that he's going to fight. So I don't know if I can say he's not focused, but uh, there is a difference. I, I do agree with you, Rodney. I haven't heard anything from Mayweather, and he normally has the biggest mouth of either side. So we'll see how that how that plays so, out. So doesn't that make Mayweather look like a little punk? Because now his whole career he's talking and talking, but this fight he's not talking. So basically he's already off his game. Because that's not what he does. For the 47 and 0 fights, he's been running his mouth, and the only the one fight that he put, could potentially lose, he's quiet. What's that? What's that show that um, Showtime puts on where they follow the fighters, or is that HBO? Um, 24 uh, seven. Yes. So we'll we'll see how quiet each both of the fighters are, or, or if they're you know talking. But just going leading into the fight. I know I'll probably want to see a little bit less from Pacquiao all the, out in the media while Mayweather's not in the media. So it just kind of paints it a certain way. It doesn't mean anything, but I just like to see him a little bit more reserved. That's all. 
All right, real quick, while we're still on this uh, of unboxing, there's a Tyson quote. He said that uh, Floyd will be hit hard, hit more and hurt more than he's ever been before in this fight. He, does, he also went on to say that he doesn't know who's going to win, but that his defensive styles might be actually overwhelmed by Pacquiao's so many hits. Any thoughts on that from everyone? Well, I believe this will Pacquiao will beat him in total punches, land and thrown. Will he win the fight? I don't know, but lands. He will win in that category. Well, th- punch is thrown. That's going to be for sure. Landed, I don't know. If he can touch him, he might beat him. Medina touched I agree. him. I agree. Uh, he's going to probably double his punch count, uh, Mayweather's, but it's all about landing those punches. So will he land them? It, it, I don't – I mean, it's up, up in the air. We haven't. Mayweather has never seen anyone like Pacquiao, and Pacquiao has never seen anyone like Mayweather. So it will be interesting to see. All right. Can't wait.